Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Pete Nova from the Face Off Sports Network. Uh, I'm here today to provide some breaking news. Josh Downs, second year wide receiver for the Indianapolis Colts, went down in seven on seven periods today. Him and Nick Cross got tied up on a play, and Josh Downs left practice early. It is being reported by Jeremy Fowler that it is a high ankle sprain. Uh, and the outlook right now is that Josh Downs could miss about a month, but the Colts are sorting all of that out right now. Now, it's good news because, you know, the, the initial thought or the worst outcome could be, did he, did he break something? Did he break his ankle? Um, but a sprain is also not the best news, especially it being high ankle. Uh, those tend to linger a lot longer. Now, the good news is Josh Downs has a, a, a rapport. He, he was a rookie last year with Anthony Richardson, so they did get some extra time in the offseason before veterans reported. And, you know, prior to Richardson getting hurt uh, last season, it did look like they had some good chemistry. Uh, but... Um, he, he's, you know, he's, he's not going to be any of the preseason games. He's not going to have a chance to gel uh, in the offense at Richardson and continue to build on that chemistry. He has been extremely impressive in camp. A lot of the reports out of Indianapolis have said that he's been um, one of the, the, the standout players of camp so far. Downs played in all 17 games last season. Uh, in those games uh, as a rookie, he had 68 catches uh, 98 on 98 targets uh, for 771 yards and only two touchdowns. He's currently being drafted as the wide receiver 61 and his cost, uh, his ADP is 148. Now the team did bring in AD Mitchell uh, via the draft, uh, but reports have been that he has been fighting with Alec Pierce, third year wide receiver uh, for the wide receiver three spot. So it seems like Mitchell still has a little ways to go uh, before he provides uh, some fantasy value for us this season, and he might be a second half of the year player. But if this injury for Josh Downs continues to linger and A.D. Mitchell uh, continues to progress in camp, there is the possibility that he ends up taking a stranglehold on the wide receiver two position uh, this season. Now, if you've listened to me on the Face Off Sports podcast – uh, Josh Downs is one of my favorite players to draft this season. Uh, you know, his cost of wide receiver 61 and going in the middle 100s at 148 is a, a really cheap cost for a guy that that commanded almost 100 targets just too shy last season as a rookie. But uh, this news is concerning uh, due to the fact that Downs, he may be ready to go week one, but will he be 100% and will this be an injury that lingers? Now, he does have a full month until the season starts, and so that's a good amount of time for him to um, you know, rest that ankle. It's not like he's injured during the season and they're trying to rush him back or he's trying to rush back to get back into – the games um, to play during the season. So that's a one benefit that he doesn't have to push himself um, to come back a little bit earlier, even if he isn't a hundred percent, I'd much rather him miss week one, week two, if it means he's fully 100% healthy uh, for the rest of the way. And if his ADP continues to drop, I'm totally comfortable uh, taking a swing on him at his current price, which is really not expensive as is. So we'll continue to monitor the situation uh, you know, hopefully Josh Downs and uh, and this this Colts offense can take the step forward this season, uh, like many expected. But hang with us here at the Face Off Sports Network, and uh, we'll see you next time.